I'm almost done. Hey, I'm just getting started good here. That's going to be a gas fireplace, isn't it? You're done already? Yep. I even have a wood mantle picked out for it. Yeah, I can picture it now. You're really working hard there, honey. Yeah, this jack here. It won't hardly jack it up off the truck. That's as high as it'll go. It won't even lift it up off my truck. Well, you know the ultimate jack wins hands down every time. Yeah, you're right. If you can see from our demonstration, we're using a standard jack. You need some type of a block to go under a trailer or something like this. You've got to carry with you all the time. It's a lot of trouble. To... Also, you're taking the possibility of an accident of pulling off this somebody getting hurt. Also, with a standard jack, it requires a number of cranks to bolt down and up and back up to the stove position. The ultimate jack it does away with both of those problems. As you can see here, one of the advantages to the ultimate trailer jack is you can pull the jack up flush with the bottom of the trailer. You're going across uneven terrain. You don't hang the jack, you don't hit the jack, or cause damage to the trailer. Also, when you extend the jack flush with the ground, it doesn't require any blocks. So the cranking time is minimal. You don't have to stand there and crank, crank, crank on it. Plus, you still have 14 inches of travel on the jack if you need some extra lift up on a, on a high truck. Let me take a minute to demonstrate how the ultimate trailer jack operates. You first remove the safety pin, turn the latch, drop the jack down, turn the latch back, lock it in position, then you reinsert the safety pin, turn the jack just like you would a normal jack.